Welcome back, guys. Thanks for taking the time to spend a little time with me. I always appreciate that. And I would like to welcome you back to the film room for film study. So let's go ahead and take a look at this, guys. We're going to let the play run at regular speed. And before I do that, let me tell you exactly what you're viewing. I'm playing on All Madden. And I think All Madden is really going to be the difficulty setting that I'm going to go with this year with my offline stuff. It's playing pretty good. 15 minute quarters and I plan to do some streams of that as well. The only thing that I did adjust is I did turn down the CPU's pass blocking and run blocking down to 35. Might inch it back up, but I'm getting a great game here. All right, now take a look. I'm playing with the Vikings. Here's the play. We'll let that play out. Boom, I throw the touchdown. All right, so now let's go take a look at why that happened. Oops. We'll go ahead and move forward here just a bit. And we're going to focus on this right here. Let's take a look at the line play. Line play is pretty good. You know, of course, you know, I would like to see the animations and the interactions and things like that get cleaned up. Um, but what I'm looking for when I look at the line is I'm looking at behavior. You know, we understand that you're going to get some weird things from time to time with the animation with physics being involved now uh, you're not seeing too many problems with clipping but you are going to see some body clips and things like that we understand that that happens so i'm looking at everyone here on the line pretty good speed it up here come over here to this side we'll look at khalil and his guy you know the double team coming right there let it play out here looks pretty good you know the interaction right there you know it was a little bit of shift there from the defensive um, side but like I said guys we know this stuff now you know it's about getting these things improved so what I'm basically looking at is just how these guys are reacting in terms of how they're playing you know their people or whatever uh, you know what they're doing behavior wise all right now we're gonna take a look at this from a bird's eye view let's go ahead and run it right here and stop all right now what we're looking at here, we want to look at what's happening here. It's a zone coverage here in the middle, as you can see, and I'll back it up a little bit so you can see what I'm talking about. But right in this area, we got zone coverage. This guy's playing zone as well. The two outside guys are running with the vertical. And you have the safety right here looking in both directions right y'all see that all right let's let it run yeah I still have it paused here for a moment but here we go we'll let it run a bit all right so you see what's taking place here right all right so let's speed this up just a bit Bear with me, guys. I'm going to lock down on this safety right here. All right, so we're going to pause it. For just a moment right here. So like I said, his responsibility first, look here, <laughs> look at the quarterback. Then he needs to see what's coming this way. He needs to see what's coming that way. And in some cases, he needs to get on his horse and run this way, right? So let's look and see what he does. Scanning the field, doing a great job. But what I want to show you is right, right about here. You'll see it here in just a moment. You know, if I can get my camera work together. You'll see here in just a moment. Let me speed it up. Right there. All right. We're going to stop it right there. Look at what he does. He commits to the inside. So that leaves Diggs out here on a one-on-one. Diggs has speed. And that's what happens. As I pan it around in here again so you guys can see it. And by the time he realizes the ball is thrown, it's too late. It's too late. All right. So let's speed it up. And we'll show it to you again right here. I'll play it from here. Oops. Sorry about that. We'll play it from right about here. Ball is already thrown. And it's too late. And this is why he gets beat. Okay? Now, to me, this is good football. These are the things that happen in football. 
You know, I think what has what has happened to a lot of people who play video games, you know, we get into the mindset of everything is supposed to work at all times. You know, why didn't this safety play over there? Why didn't this corner do this? Why didn't this receiver do that? Why didn't this guy do this? But we have to respect when we see real football. And that's what this film study is all about, guys. I'm going to be showing football principles, the good things that are happening in Madden. I'm also going to point out things that needs to improve. Like in my last video, I showed the DN situation. All right. And this is what I'm going to be doing this year, you know, in terms of when I decide to do these breakdowns, you know, it's going to be film study episodes one, two, three, what have you. And that's how I'm going to do it. And it'll be spare moment stuff. You know, I have other stuff coming, but you know, I hope you guys enjoy this content, but this was an outstanding play. I made the right read and I get the touchdown. And this is on all Madden difficulty. And then the safety reacts accordingly. Dang. <laughs> so there it is, guys. I definitely appreciate you guys watching. Definitely leave your thoughts and comments. And stay tuned for a few short messages. Peace. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Wait, wait, wait. Before you go, hit that sub box. Make sure you subscribe. Come back around for more content. And don't forget to leave your thoughts. Leave your comments, and I promise it'll never hurt you to hit that like button. Another announcement real quick, guys. Sim Standard Radio has now moved here to YouTube via Google Hangout. Come check us out right here every Thursday night at 8 p.m. Eastern. All right, that's all I got for you. Okay, bye, bye-bye. Go ahead, get out of here.